Yeah. Hold on, I, I might need I might need your help. Nope. Welcome back everybody to How Did the Garage. I haven't had much time because I've been working a lot of overtime to work on the truck. I know a lot of y'all subscribe to the channel for the bikes. So I'm going to do a bike video. I'm going to do a walkover, walk through uh, the best that I can. I'm at work on break because of course I'd never do this on a company time. But so what we got here is a 2022 Lowrider ST. And it is not stock by no means. He has an aftermarket seat on it. Real nice and cushy. He says he likes it a lot better from, than the stock one. I would have him in the video, but he says he gets camera shot. I don't know. Anyways, as far as the engine, it comes with the 117. And he has a cam and a tune on it, I believe. And exhaust, of course, as you can see. Uh, I think he said on the dyno... It made around 119, 120, somewhere around in there. It is really dirty at the moment. It has the uh, copper colored wheels on it. it. Has the saddle bags. And what he was saying, a lot of people have issues with these bags coming undone. But as he explained, it has a little indication marks right here showing when they're down. This is how you open it. And there's the knob on the inside to release it. And it's, I don't know, I can't even get to come undone. But I guess that red thing, when it's unlatched, it'll come all the way up here to pull it off. But, I mean, it has an indication on both sides. So I don't see how somebody would have issues with these falling off. Right now, I can't even wiggle on it and get it to pull off. I don't know if you got to push on it or pull on it, but maybe you got to pull on it. Oh, there we go, you got to pull on it. But yeah, it has a little indication thing on it. Latches back in, I don't see how somebody have issues with it has shocks on it right there it's neat i like it oh yeah latch it back up here yep it's all blacked out eventually i plan on doing something like this tomorrow and getting it all blacked out and real nice he got some new grips on it i don't know what kind of grips he got but they, they feel pretty comfortable has the tuner thing right here has the digital view like my breakout has that rough finish i like that the fairings is fixed it doesn't turn with the steering wheel like I said, it is dirty. He does ride it. He is a rider. He has aftermarket uh, LED lights on here that I think is pretty badass. He bought from Harley. I'm not sure the name brand or anything, but let's turn this thing on. Dino jet. I don't know much about it, so I'm not going to start poking shit. We turn the blinker on. Right, It stays. It's kind of like a headlight at first. But, you know, it brightens the road up for you turn the blinker on does that when you turn it on oh shit it's the horn it fades back in it's pretty badass i like that do it again yep yeah. we getting something like that for mine let y'all hear this thing that's what y'all want to hear right you're at cam sounds nice all this is stock it comes with the led brake light stock uh our regular bulbs don't have led turn signals in the back but it does have the tail lights has the vent in the front for air has bugs on it Ooh -wee. this thing feels different than the breakout <laughs> a lot different than the breakout feels pretty comfortable though oh goodness it does not have forward controls like the breakout Breakouts up here, I like it, but I don't like this. It's in between a crotch rocket and a breakout. It's sitting straight up though, handlebars ain't too far. Yeah, I like it. It'd probably be comfortable riding this thing versus the breakout. It feels a lot more top heavier. Make sure your kickstand's down before I set it down. I hate to drop this bike. That looks fancy. More vents there and there for air. Has a uh, cruise control, I believe. 
Yep, cruise control. I like it. We'll hear this thing one more time. I like it, Cam. All in all, it's a pretty slick bike. I like it. I believe it's considered a maybe a stage one, stage two. I think maybe a stage one. I don't know. I don't know. You might. He does. He don't want to get on camera. I know he said it has the cam, like I said, and the tune and the exhaust on it, wherever that is. Sounds nice. It don't sound like a damn sewing machine by no means. He said to get up and go too. He says the accidentally done some power wheelies on it. Well, that's all I got, just a little quick video. Well, that's all I got, just a little quick walk around this 2022 uh, uh, Lowrider ST. But as always, I gotta get back here and fix some stuff. Till next time.